Hi, I'm Dr. Jim, and in this video, we're going to demonstrate the pinky loop muscle test. So you're going to take the pinky and the thumb. I typically use my non-dominant hand, so my left hand, and I'm going to squeeze my, index, my pinky and my thumb together. I'm going to take my right hand, I'm going to take my thumb and my index finger, and I'm going to place these two together. I'm going to take the two fingers up inside the loop. I'm going to put my fingers in the loop, and the goal is to try and separate my fingers. So when I place it in here, again, I'm going to always establish a yes and establish a no. So my pinky and my thumb come together, index finger and thumb come together on the other hand, and I'm going to open, and I say, show me yes, and I try and separate, and the, the two fingers stay tight together. I take my fingers out, and I'll say, show me no, and I come up together, and they will open up, they will give, they will have a little hesitation, they will break. Pinky and thumb, index finger and thumb in the middle of the loop. And then again, remember, start asking yourself simple questions. My name is Jim, and I open its closed. My name is Bob, and it won't. My name is Bob, and it breaks it free. So when I am intending on testing myself for something, say I'm standing in an aisle at the store, and I'm looking at uh, a different brands of food, whatever the food might be. And I can intentionally, intentionally look at this and say, is this one best for me, yes or no? Yes or no? And then I'll go to the next one. Is this one good for me, yes or no? If there's two that are good for you, which one's to my highest well-being? Which one's the best for me and my family at this point in time? Show me yes and show me no. And that is the pinky loop muscle test. Remember to keep practicing. The more you practice, the better you get.